Hi everyone, it's Tiffany. I am back in Disney Dreamlight Valley. We have a handful of things to do today. I'm super excited. You see my pumpkins are ready over there and I did do a big pump. What's this? Goodness level check. What is that? Okay, guess I gotta go take that to Donald. But anyway, <laughs> what was I saying? Oh yeah, my money. So we're back up to well, well, I don't know what we were at. We were like at low hundreds, I think. I'm at 197. You may think that's low, especially if I did a big pumpkin harvest, but I upgraded Moana's boat to its full potential. So we have no other things I believe that we need to be, that need to be upgraded at this point. So now we're gonna see if we can craft the snow family. Oh, okay, it all happens at once. I thought we'd have to do one indiv the, them all individually. So we get to craft the whole snowman family. So let's just go ahead and do that for Anna. Then we gotta go take that sign to Donald and all of that jazz. Maybe we uh, recap and see what we can make here at the sign, at the sign, at the, <laughs> at the workshop bench. Okay, snow family, uh, gold ingot, 10 gold ingots. Maybe we can make those, hold on, let's see here. 10, oh gosh, we could definitely make 10. 10 gold ingots. All right, cool. And then, actually, do I need to craft something after I make those? Yeah, Ariel's crafting station. It's so cute, I love it. All right, so we'll go ahead and make that for her. And then we'll definitely go back into the quest just to check to see if there's anything else. I made the let, let Buzz Life light your leaflets, goodness. Um, we're still short on iron for Kristoff's and Minnie's. Gotta take that to him. I gotta find where these ones are, I forgot. And then we have a new quest with Ursula. Cause I've been giving her all of her favorite gifts. Well, not all of them, but most of her favorite gifts every day. <laughs> so, anywho, let's see, what shall we do first? I wanna take this sign to Donald, it intrigues me. Uh, we have, we have, uh, Maybe I should look for these. Sorry, I'm... Where should I go first? <laughs> Let's see where people are on the map. Anna's down here. I gotta take this up to the... Actually, I gotta edit the Forest of Valor and put the Snow Family up there. I don't know where I gotta put the... Um, what are they called? Uh, Seriously, what are they called? Uh, This. Hold on. The crafting station. I don't remember where I gotta put that, so maybe I should check on that oh okay i guess we're taking a photo together family photo this is actually kind of cute that's adorable um can i switch angles though hold on now that's the format we want yeah this is what we want look at that so cute i can't really get a nice middle shot i'm gonna have to block well maybe we just do these girls Oh, I ruined that one. Oh, Anna ruined that one. All right, that one's good. <laughs> Sorry, Kristoff, you were cut out of that. Okay, I needed to take that picture. Got it. And let's talk to Anna since she's right here. That was incredible. We reminded Elsa of our favorite childhood memories. Yay. And we made some new ones. Thank you so much, Tiffany. I have a feeling we'll go on a lot more adventures together. I can't wait. I'm so happy you're here in Dreamlight Valley, Anna. Me too. You've made it such a special place. Here, I want you to have this just to show how much you mean to me. Oh, pretty. Falls bounty gown. Nice. All right. So now, let's see. Oh, Ariel is literally right there. I just don't know where she wants her... Where does she want it? Give, oh, we give it to her. I thought we were placing it. It was in our furniture, so that's confusing, I guess. But anyway, hi, Ariel. There you go. Have your crafting station. I hope you love it. It's so cute. I low-key want it myself. Oh, oh, thank you, Tiffany. It's fantastic. Now that you've helped me start collecting again, I can't fix anything if I find that's broken. Pretty soon, I'll have the most wonderful collection in the village. You are such a good friend. You're welcome. Okay, cool. There's a chest here. I'm gonna grab that. And get that cute little gift that I got. Here, let's use it. All right, nice blazer. So let's see what is next on our agenda. So of course we have to go find Donald. That's on our thing. 
Oh, we gotta find these. So I know, I remember Goofy's house having something. I'm not sure which item it was, but it had something. Plus Goof, Donald, sorry, is at Remy's. So let's, we're gonna start up here in the village. We're gonna go in to Remy's just to see Donald first. Then we're going to go from there. Hi, Donald. Donald. Hey, Donald. I found a sign with a picture of you in the peaceful meadow, but it looks like someone drew on it. What? That's the big idea. Who would? Oh, I know who it was. It was Stitch. If he does that again, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Calm down. Take a deep breath. Calm down. Why should I calm down? Every time I turn around, Stitch wrecks something else. Why did Stitch do? What did Stitch do to get you so riled up? First, he won't stop bothering me, leaving teeth marks on my pontoon, stealing the worms out of my tackle box, and then he asked me if I was ugly as a duckling. I think. I think you may have misunderstood Stitch. See, one of his favorite stories is the ugly duckling. I don't misunderstand anything. He's got it in for me. So I put up those signs around the village to tell Stitch to keep out of my favorite places. Smart idea. Good fences make great neighbors. Exactly. The way That way we won't have any more misunderstandings. But did Stitch follow the signs? No. Not once. Not ever. But that's not all. He drew funny pictures all over him. Maybe I can talk to Stitch and try to teach him... Your, to respect your property. Thank you. If Stitch doesn't leave me alone, I'm going to fix up that spaceship of his and send him to the moon. Cool. I will go. I got to go see Stitch. But I'm going to stop at all of these houses. Well, I know Goofy's house at least. Did we check Minnie's? We definitely checked Minnie's house. I don't know. And we went to Remy's house. That's right. Um, Where else do we go? Do we go? We went to Mickey's house. That's where we found the top or whatever, right? I'm pretty sure. Was it Wally's house? <gasps> it was Wally's house, wasn't it? Because we, he was talking about how he had that in his, oh, there it is. He had that in his, his house. All right, cool. So we'll go stop at Wally's and then, well, honestly, I don't know. We're just going with it. We're getting done what we think we can get done. I need to stop holding this gosh dang watering can. <laughs> Hi, Wally. Don't mind me. I'm just going to... Oh, my. I'm just going to go into your house really quickly and see if I can find... the. Well, we found the bowling pin. What was it that we're missing? What is this? Oh, a light bulb. That's right. Cool. So now, I might need to talk to Wally or Ariel. I don't know who, but we'll find out because Wally's right here. Hi, Wally. Nope. Wrong kid. Hi, Wally. No, Wally. Wally! <laughs> Gosh dang it, Wally. Get me out of here. All right, please still be here because if he zoomed off, okay, there he is. All right, so now, there we go. Give him, oh, I thought I had to give Ariel those ones. Maybe Ariel was the other one. I I was just confused. Okay. Wally. Here are all the things for your exchange. Now, let's go see Ariel. Whoopee. All right, so I gotta go to to Wally and Ariel. Where are they going is the question. Where's Ariel? Oh, she's going to the beach. She's going to the beach, everyone. That's okay. While I wait for Wally to get here, I can grab Moana's boat fish. Might have time to sell them, too. We shall see. But now I get 20 fish for free, which is great. I love it. Love it. And there's some good fish in there, too. Alright, how long is it per collection five minutes dang okay i think that isn't the full collection though but i'm not sure there's wally no wally wally come back where are you going buddy he's just pacing back and forth over there maybe he's waiting for me to get here wally 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 hey bud hey buddy okay Alright, I don't know how they, I mean, I guess they probably talk, I don't, ta-da! Aw, look at them, they're doing a little cute little exchange, light bulb, oh my gosh, that's so sweet. I haven't been to Stitch's house yet. Oh, Wally, these are amazing, I've never seen anything like them before, thank you so much. Hmm, what can I trade you for these? Us, uh, I know. Plates, cool. Look at this. It's a human toy made of something called porcelain. 
Ooh! A robot and a mermaid. They throw it back and forth, and the first one to drop it and break it loses. Wait, what? <laughs> wow! And here, this is called a hat. Humans put them on their heads. Um, that's a th that's a thimble. Wally. Yes, you can wear it too. It'll look very nice on you. And this is a musical instrument. The needles make a really pretty sound. A clock. <laughs> wow! Cool. Oh! I'm glad you can start training trinkets with Ariel again. Whoopee! Yay, that's so sweet. All right, Stitch, where are you, buddy? There you go. Hold on. Wait. Don't walk too fast, Stitch. I'm coming for you. Ooh, we have two people up here. Oh, sorry, Buzz. I hear you and Donald have been having some misunderstandings. No misunderstandings. Stitch to prank. Donald go, <laughs> Donald is my funny friend. Friends? You're pranking Donald because you think it's funny when he's mad? Some people don't like to be pranked, Stitch. Donald's getting really upset. You have to respect his boundary. Oh, I did that all the wrong voice. Donald's getting really upset. You have to respect his boundaries. Oh, you want me to stop pranking Donald? Is Stitch's badness level too high? <laughs> Sorry. I need... I can't, I can't with the stitch voice. Okay, it's it's bad. It's rough. Um, <laughs> of course not. You're just a little rambunctious. Stitch will do better, I promise. Why don't we start by replacing those signs you drew on? I'll teach you to repair stuff. Let's go fix Donald's signs. We'll need to find hardwood, softwood, and those vandalized signs. You're there. I'm Hi, Buzz. How convenient. Excellent work, cadet. When they see these, no one will doubt that space rangers are a force to be reckoned with. In fact, I'll personally deliver one to Ursula. How about I take it to Ursula? You're too high ranking for a job like this. Smart thinking. Perhaps encountering a cadet instead of an officer will convince her that we don't regard her as a threat. And if her intimidation tactics don't scare us, that might be enough for, to deter her from her nefarious plans. Great way to show how in great way to show initiative, cadet. Uh. Since you've proven yourself, I'll let you pick two other villagers to help spread the word about Starkman. I'll go with Maui and Donald. They're both heroes. Why Donald? Then they're sure to appreciate Starkman's mission to help. I approve. Okay. So now we go. Um, let's maybe talk to everybody, depending. Okay, Maui's going up that way. So let's, let's, oh, goodness, we don't want to lose him. Maui. Maui, 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 it's me. Get hey. over here. Here you go. You are part of Stark Man. Hey, what what's took this? You so long? It's got a bunch of pictures on it. I'm oh, I met this guy. It's that little fella, Buzz. It's Buzz Lightyear leaflet. It tells the legends of Buzz Lightyear and Star Command. Command. Um, they last of the sun. He escaped a fiery inferno. <laughs> Gotta respect that. But if I never heard of this. Starkman. It can't be a very well-known legend. Oh, yeah. I get it. It's not that easy to build a legend when you're just starting out. You always need help to get your stories around. Tell you what, I'll help you spread the legend of Buzz Lightyear and the Star Command. Thank All you. Right. All right, Donald. Actually, I don't know where you're at. Uh, Scrooge Duck, Remy, Donald. Okay, he's in the restaurant. Donald, it's me. You're always welcome at my restaurant. There you go. Stark man poster for you. Huh? What's this? A bunch of funny pictures of Buzz? It's a Buzz Lightyear leaflet. I'm trying to spread the word about all this, his most daring feats, like his many heroic rescue missions. Well, I bet he hasn't done anything as brave as helping me get out of the dark grove. Since you did that for me, and since you obviously need some help, I'll tell everybody about Buzz and his space rangers. Thank you. I just gotta go to Ursula. I gotta talk to her anyway, so that's good. Quests are really working out today. Oh no, she's in her house. Okay, that's fine. We can like hang back, I think. Do we, well, do we have other things to do? Might be like the only thing we have to do. Uh, yep, we're waiting, waiting. Oh, we gotta find the vandalized signs. 
Maybe we do that. Where did it say they were? Hold the phone. Where are they? Uh, near the entrances to the peaceful meadow. So we already got two. Where am I going? Oh my goodness. So there might be one on this side. If there's three, but there's like four slash five entrances. So we shall see. Guess not here. I'm going to guess over here. Yeah, I see it. Pumpkins. I'm going to have to do a big harvest tonight. I made Stitch a helper in the garden, so he'll get to help me. All right, so now I need hardwood and softwood. That's not gonna be a problem. Honestly, instead of going back home, I'm just gonna collect them myself around here. Because honestly, I've really been needing to do that. Not that necessarily, but not like, I just need to go around and collect things. I had a day where I did that, but I only managed to do the, uh, what is it called? Um, the village and the peaceful meadow and then by the time i was done with the like i went did the village first by the time i was done with the village the peaceful meadow i went there then the village had already respawned so it was already time to collect there it's it's been a lot but i'm gonna get this so i don't think it'll be all that hard to get softwood and hardwood in my inventory without having to go back home and collect it that way so we'll just keep on here with what we're doing Honestly, like, really need to get all of these night thorns up because I've been slacking in that department. So, anyway. Also, these little uh, gator guys, I think they, I think they like fish, but I should probably double check on that before I start feeding them things. Although I do have a fish in my inventory, don't I? I need to like chase them. All right, the ones that I have to chase, I don't like the, the raccoons. They will not let me catch them. I don't. Maybe I just don't know how to properly chase them catch them you know anyway hardwood this is good that i'm finding lots of hardwood I, is it hardwood it's that's softwood that one's definitely hardwood all right yeah i'm glad i'm finding a bunch because it's harder to find especially since the forest we find it in the forest do we find it we might find it in the forgotten lands as well no because that's dry wood and dark wood anyway Lots of fun stuff here. I do need to do those dig spots, but I just don't want to do that. What if I... Can I try to catch you? This might be too excessive. I don't really want to try to catch you right now, because you're running really fast. Okay, you're going again. Wait, I think maybe I gotta wait. I don't know. I gotta look up how to... Whoop! Yeah, we'll do that later, because I'm on a mission right now. So let's go to the forest, I guess, because that's where the next best place for hardwood will be. Can't think off the top of my head where the next best place will be. I think I should just check the uh, collections tab and see where it's located. I think, oh, maybe uh, Frosted Heights. Frosted Heights definitely has some. Well, anyway, we don't need all that much more either, so. Should be pretty easy to get here. Just gonna try my best to find it. Don't see any there, but I will get this night thorn for you, Buzz. It's right in front of your door, so gotta get that. Okay, so let's go over to the side, and then if we don't pull up anything, we will go over to the Frosted Heights, but I feel like I did some of that this morning and got all of it, but maybe not. Maybe I did not. All right, so I'm literally looking for one more hardwood. I think that is extremely doable. Honestly, we probably will find it here if if I'm not completely out there. Are the, no, those are softwood, so I'm pretty sure. Okay, that would have been good if one of those... Oh, there's one. Ooh, here's some softwood, too. Gonna get some extra. <laughs> I gotta clear out these forests. I haven't really done much work. I did a lot of work on that side where Elsa lives, but I didn't do much work over here yet. Alright, so now what do I do? Give some of the materials to Stitch. So where is my boy Stitch? All right, so I should say my alien. <laughs> my alien Stitch. Oh, Stitch, I'm here. Hey, buddy. Oh, he's so cute, he's sitting by the fire. Hey, man. Can't, can I talk to you? There we go. Give. There you go, there's some, oh, five, five. And one so I only give you part of it oh what's this it's some of what we'll need to repair the signs watch me repair a couple of them at the crafting station and then you could try fixing one yourself okay instead we got it fixing and destroying 
Mm-hmm. All right, I'm gonna go to the crafting station. And beyond. <laughs> no, just to the crafting station. <laughs> All right, so. Oops. Hi, Moana. She's always hanging up here. Hey, girl. All right. So let's get to the furniture. Donald sign. I make two, right? I think I make two. I hope so. I mean, that's all the material I have. So show the repaired signs to Stitch. Okay, he's in the cotton. I got to get him out of here so I could talk to him. There we go. There you go. Nice. He's so cute. Here are the signs I fixed. Whoa. Can Stitch fix sign now? If you're ready, let's do this. Whoa, Just be careful, okay? Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Look, Stitch make it better than before, yeah? Looks great. Thank you. Let's go place these signs around the peaceful meadow. That should show Donald that you can respect his space in the village. Okay. So, okay, he's got to give them all back to me, I guess. I thought I already had them. So now, I guess we'll go in furniture, go to the signs. I guess we'll just, I'm gonna end up moving these if I'm being quite honest, cause like, you know I don't. I'm not a huge fan of these kind of decorations if they don't go with my aesthetic. But we'll put them where we found them just because. I mean, we could literally put them all in one place, but I'm gonna be nice and we're gonna put them where we found them basically. All right, now what, talk to Stitch. We fix signs and put them back. Is Stitch goodness level high now? Not quite. You still need to apologize to Donald. Apologies really help boost your goodness level. Mm. Uh, you want Stitch to say oh. sorry? Stitch not good at sorry. Oh. Don't worry. If you mean it, saying sorry is easy. Most important thing is to say it from the heart. We find Donald, I say sorry. I hope Donald's still at the restaurant. Oh no, he's up here though. Okay, they're running toward each other. Oh gosh. Okay, here we go. I will catch them. Let's see, they're here somewhere. Aha. What? Not you again. They literally have the same voice. What kind of trick are you gonna pull on me this time? No trick. Just say sorry. Sorry? Now I know you're pulling a, f I almost said fast one, a prank. I'm too smart to fall for it. No, no, no trick. Oh my gosh, they sound the same. When I can't do a character's voice, I just default to that one. Tiffany helps Stitch fix sign and helps Stitch say sorry. I'm sorry. From Stitch's heart bottom, just like Tiffany say. Well, if this really isn't a trick, then, oh, I guess I forgive you. Aww. But I'll be keeping an eye on you, and you better not try anything again. Help Stitch now. Hello. Donald likes Stitch. Sorry, right? Uh, you did a great uh, job. I keep goodness level high. Promise. Uh, Only prank Donald sometimes. Yeah, hey, hey, hey. Cool. Do I gotta talk to Stitch again? Did it say? It didn't say. All right. I think I did that. I think we're good. Now we must go find Ursula who is in her house. Gosh dang it. I mean, I don't have to. I mean, I can wait. There's other things I could do. <sighs> okay, I really can't do these. I don't think, maybe I can do the iron ingots now though. I don't know. I will, we need to see what we're sitting at. I feel like I might've gotten enough iron since the last time I checked, but let's check. So we need to make 10 iron ingots. Nope. Gotta go hunting for some iron. Tinker parts. Oh gosh, we need iron ingots for tinker parts too, but I might be able to go back to Wally's realm and get them. I don't know how that works. All right, I'm gonna have to lure Ursula out. And by lure Ursula out, I'm just gonna have to move her house. I hate having to do that. I really like having their houses way out on the ocean, but ugh, I hate moving them. Let me double check she's still in there. All right, she definitely is. All right, we're gonna move her closer. Temporarily, of course. Can I enter through this way? I have no idea. I'm just gonna 
put her there. And let's see. I don't know. Actually, can I enter? I had it appeared there for a second. There we go. All right, Ursula. Hello, I'm here. Oh, it's you. Just who I was hoping to see. Uh, let's star a space ranger reputation. And what's this? Ugh, you're bothering me about that annoying little creature again. Angelfish, wouldn't it be better if I turned him into something that couldn't move or talk? A sea anemone, perhaps. Why are you so angry? Ask yourself, dear, how would you react if someone was constantly harassing you who's simply because of who you are? I'd prove them I could be nice. Those who see themselves in authority rarely change their minds. Just look at Triton. Oh, but I've been playing this game for long enough to know what to do. I'll pretend I respect the irritating little plaything. Goodbye. Great, dear. sounds good. Um, ah, uh, just the guinea pig I need. You'll help me with a little magical experimentation, won't you? Just a trifling thing, really. I doubt anyone will get hurt. It's just a little power extraction spell using that flower you acquired. What do you say? Uh, you doubt anyone will get hurt? Oh, don't be so dramatic, dearie. Huh. We'll set it up for the spell and I'll be sh I'll make sure it's safe. Promise. First, we need a seashell, but not just any seashell. We need one from that girl who's always talking to the ocean, Moana. Once you have that, find some aquamarine and squid. Then combine all those things together in an enchantment potion and bring it to me. Oh, someone's on the road. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Woody, let's go. <laughs> so, let's put Ursula's house back. Alright. Eh, something like that. Good enough. Alright. So we return to Buzz. We can also we gotta talk to Moana, actually. Let's just just go do that really quickly. Uh it'll probably take us a while to get the squid we need, depending on how many squid we need. And Moana might end up catching us a squid. But the Forgotten Lands usually oh, have squid I often. Hi Tiffany! Wow, you seem so busy. Can I help you with something? Yeah, Ursula told me to talk to you, the sea witch. Are you sure it's a good idea to listen to her? She's hungry for power. Yeah, she reminds me of a giant crab I met. I hope you don't get caught in whatever she's up to. You said she asked you to get a seashell from me? Well, I did find this one on the beach. I thought it was a gift from the ocean, but maybe it's a gift to you. Be careful. Thank you. Just find me later. Okay, so now I'm pretty sure. Let me see if I have any squid. I do have squid. So let me see. Uh, I need six squid, actually, for this. Let's go see where Buzz is, because I could probably do... Uh, he's up there. I don't know. I think I'll just collect up the squid, because it'll take me a minute. Eh, it won't take me too long, but... I'd rather turn in the quest for Buzz right now. Gosh, where is he? Buzz, where the heck did you go? You were just here! Oh my gosh, he is running down to the beach. Right where I just was at. Buzz. Buzz. Watch him let him not be here now. Is he? Oh my gosh. How are you running so fast? Buzz, stop it. <laughs> Mission accomplished, cadet. Peace has been restored in the village. And from what I hear, Maui and Donald have already started spreading the good word about Star Command. And Ursula seems to have gotten the message. I have no reports of any schemes by her. Glad it could be of service. Thanks, Tiffany. I'll let you know when I find a new mission for us. Work. Cool. So now... Recapping the quest, we really only have this one to work on. I mean, we gotta work on getting iron. And probably clay. I don't know how much we actually have. Maybe I'll take some time and actually put in a lot more effort into mining and getting... I don't even think I have 100 hardwood. I don't know. But I gotta work on getting all of these. And the iron ingots. And then we should be able to tackle those in the next episode. Fingers crossed. For now, I think... I don't know. I think the, the squid thing's going to be very doable. It'll probably probably won't take me all that long. Um, honestly, I might... I could even probably wait out Moana's boat and she could probably catch them all for me. <laughs> so anyway, let me make the empty vial. Well, should I... Maybe I'll hold off on making the empty vial in case I do catch the squid. And I still want to give Ursula her daily presence and I don't want to, you know, go ahead and do that quest without you guys. So anyway... 
Recapping once again, we have these two, which I'm going to work on getting parts for. Don't I have that outfit? Anyway. And then this one, we're just going to work on getting the squid, which will be easy peasy. Just got to, I definitely, I think they're in the glade as well, but they're definitely in the forgotten lands too. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.